hey, before you watch this video, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. It really helps. Thank you. I'm either going to start my Phantom Liberty playthrough tonight, or I am going to work on like round two of Starfield. I just got a lot of videos to edit today. When I get home, I, I want to try and get all those Diablo, all the Diablo videos up for my one to 100. But we'll see. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Just said exactly what I was going to do, Emily. Hmm. So this laptop uh, came in. This is a Lenovo IdeaPad 3. Came in uh, not detecting a hard drive. So we're going to see. I have a strange suspicion this is an SSD. And if that's the case, then unfortunately, this bad boy is uh, all that's all the data on this is going to be gone. So we'll see here. Get the screws out. And then we just got to go along this edge here and Give it a little bit of gentle persuasion. Open it up. And we do have an SSD. It's a team group SSD. That's not a good sign for this person. Let's start by trying to plug it into an external computer. I'm gonna start there. And plug it into my backup rack and see what, if anything, shows up. Hopefully something shows up. If not, I can do a little bit of investigation under the microscope to see, see if it's something to do with something on the SSD itself. I guess this doesn't want to stay. Yes, this thing is Ooh, this SSD is deed. Indeed, it is unconscious. It is no longer functioning. All right, let's take a look at it under the microscope. Wasn't expecting that this morning, but here we are. All right. This was, like I said, very unexpected. I wasn't expecting to start off my morning by doing this. Exposure, let's get this down to zero. Menu, all right. Let's get out my tweezers. Nah, you're fine, you know just as much as I do, man. Let me get this sticker off of here. All right, let's take a look at this. See if we see anything that stands out. That looks fine. We're going to grab a multimeter here in a second. So this bothers me. I feel like something should be here. But there's, I'm seeing there's a lot of just uh, like not populated spaces. All right, let's grab a multimeter. Actually, what is this?
That's a that is a wild looking diode. You can see just that little bit, little bit of wire going through there. All right, let's grab a multimeter and see what we get. What is this? Enhance. <laughs> that looks like a, a little roach. I don't know what it is with me and finding roach infested computers lately. I'm not finding any shorts. Well, I should have continuity here, but I do not for some reason. That could be nothing. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Thanks, man. All right, we're gonna plug this in up here. We're gonna plug this in and we're gonna check it to see if anything gets hot. It's like this, it's like the power circuit isn't even turning on. This is a, a wild looking diode. If that is a diode, I do not have continuity across this diode. Certainly looks like a diode. Is it, could it be a one way? No. All right, let me check some other things real quick. I just need to unenhance. So here's the problem. Like I can't find, like this thing isn't making it to ground. And if that is a diode, then something along the way caused that diode fail. So that's the dump. All right, let's grab some tools real quick. All right, let's move you there. Put out my mat. My gamer's Nexus solder mat. Gotta be careful not to throw any of these screws anywhere. Let's pull this back around. All right, so here's what we're gonna look at. We're gonna look at taking off that. You know what, you're not wrong. Now that you're saying that, that makes perfect sense, but I should still have some sort of continuity cro across it. Like it, that's a, yeah, I should have, I should have went diode right away. And you know what? You're like, maybe I'm just not awake enough. He's right, this is the diode. Yeah, look, or it is a, hey look, it's a diode. Good call. This doesn't look very good. Holden, what would I do if you weren't here? Besides extra work. That doesn't look good. Hmm. You can see that there's a line that goes directly to this. But this is a via. So this should have continuity to that. But it should just be on the one side. Okay. Those all look good. Uh, I think the controller went on it. I think that's what's going on here. Okay, so it's looking more and more like the problem is this. As soon as my camp, this is the problem. Because I plug it in, it's the, the, the drive itself is detected. 
but the um My, my words just escape. The drive is detected, but it will not let me initialize it, which tells me that it's this that's the problem. So what I can do is I can put some captive tape on here, on all sides, put some flux on it, try and reflow this to see if that, to see if that actually helps. You never know. And then see if we get anything after that. So let me give that a try. Otherwise, I just tell her we need to re we just need to replace the the SSD and kind of go from there. And again, we're just looking for reflow here. We're not looking for like removal. So let's see if this will get this thing up and running for me. First things first. Let's. Pull out our tape. All right, we need to count to 30 here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, one, two, three, four, five, twenty six, twenty seven, eight, twenty nine, thirty. All right. Give it a couple more seconds. Right now, this should be hot enough for me to remove this chip from the board, 100%. So, let's let that cool down. We'll set that off to the side in case I need to put that back on. Yeah, we got some nice, some nice burning from that. We'll let that cool down now. And I never know how to say it right. Is it capped on? Is it captain? Is it captive? All right, moment of truth. Let's see if reflowing this had any sort of effect. Plug it in, power it on. Nope, nope, all right, so easy peasy. Dead SSD. And if she's still under warranty, she's gonna need to send it back. So let me give her a call and see. Capped on, yeah. I just don't know how to say it correctly, so I always feel like an idiot when I say it. Hey, thanks for watching that video. If you liked that video, make sure you hit the like button. If you want to see more videos like this, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And I stream daily on Twitch at twitch.tv slash specvengeance. And uh, yeah, if you want to learn more about my services, check out BradentonPCRepair.com. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you on the next one.